Hi, this is a six part series learning how to visualize data in Postman. We just added a visualizer and added a layout. In this video, we're gonna pass data from our API to the layout. Let's head over to Postman and move on to step four in our get started folder. Now that we've added pm.visualizer.set and defined an initial layout for our front end view, let's take a look at the second parameter data. This is an object that we can bind to the template. In our example code, we see another placeholder, this time for the second parameter in pm.visualizer.set. Once again, we're using the PM object in the Postman sandbox. This time, pm.response.json captures the response return from the API so we can parse the response body as JSON. In our string template, we can use the handlebars templating engine to help us render the data returned from our API using a syntax like double curly braces or handlebars to wrap around our handlebars expression. Since we know our data looks like this coming back from our API, we can use handlebars expression each to loop through each item of our response body. If you're not that familiar with parsing objects in JavaScript, I'll say that we're looping through response.result because response is the property name we used in pm.visualizer.set and result is the property name from the response body returned from our API. Here we can use handlebars at key to reference the current key name of the objects that we're looping through, which in this case will be the date, and then add an HTML line break to separate each date with a new line. Okay, hit send and take a look at the visualize tab of our response. You should see something like this. This is progress, but if you're a front end developer or a designer, you're probably thinking it's kind of gross. Let's keep going. In this video, we pass data returned by our API to the front end layout using the pm.visualizer.set method. We use handlebars to loop through the data object, writing our expressions in the template string. Coming up next, let's make our visualization a bit prettier.